Hey guys, we are going to check out the Skyliner today. It is the opening day, so we're gonna take a ride. We're gonna stop at some resorts to get some breakfast because it's like 10 o'clock and we're hungry. But let's go check it out. I'm really excited. <laughs> Check out the Skyliner. Yeah, I'm a little nervous because it keeps stopping. Yeah, It'll be fun, fun though. I think so. We yeah. actually tried to go to Art first, but all of the resort locations along the Skyliner are at a hard close because it is opening day today. So we ended up having to come to studios. But that's okay. I'm excited. We'll see when I get up there how I feel. But I feel safer. I'm excited now. The one in California was open. Oh, the one we went to the San Diego Zoo. Yeah. All right, let's check it out. Oh, from here? Probably like 20 minutes. Piece of cake. It moves pretty fast. I can see that. It's awesome. But um, I was gonna say, oh, you have a double stroller, so by the time you get to the front, it's gonna be cold. It only fits single strollers. Hear that? Good to know. Thank you. It's really cool to see it launch. I think it all runs by solar power. Welcome aboard the Disney Skyliner at Disney's Hollywood Studios. We are on our way to Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort with connecting flights to Epcot International Gateway, Disney's Pop Century Resort, and Disney's Art of Animation Resort. Just got off our first flight. It's super backlit, so it's hard to see. But we're gonna go to Art and Pop to get breakfast. How'd you new, like it? New favorite ride. I can just write this all day. It's Abel's new favorite ride. The thing is, there's a bathroom here too. Oh, good. Okay. Well, this line is incredibly short, so we're gonna hop on here, get some breakfast, and then, Mom, when we could come back here and then just go back to Hollywood Studios. We don't have to do the long bit. I'm okay with doing it. It's I. It's uh, I don't. I'm not sure about the sway, but yeah. The breeze in there is incredibly comfortable. Yeah. Oh, good. And we're gonna get a clear one. Because I was saying, I think that the clear one would offer better views. Bye. Three. Thank you. Ooh. Yeah, I think I much prefer the clear one. Oh, okay. It's musical chairs, but musical benches. I didn't like not being able to see was another thing because I was sitting where Abel is, so right. like against the direction we were going. Right. Because um, I think I'll feel better, hopefully, on this one because I can see where we're going. Right. Abel's getting comfortable. I'm surprised he likes it, Mr. Scared of Heights. It's very clean. It's very clean. Um, the breeze was very nice.
it's definitely interesting. It's See, it's a look, fun. I think it's just moving the wire out so cool. Whee! Very cool. I like it. It's kind of peaceful. Entering Art of Animation on your right, Pop Century on your left. So we are going over our glass lake. It's weird because I have run this resort so many times. Like, you know, run this, this loop down here. Um, so it's crazy to be going over it. And we are going down a little bit too, like down into the lake. Yeah. That's crazy. Hands up. Whee! This is definitely Abel's jam. I love this. I've I seen gators in this lake though, so I don't want to go swimming. <laughs> we are now gliding over the sparkling waters of Hourglass Lake. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy the most magical flight on Earth. That's cool. <laughs> Breakfast break. You know it's a good day when you've got a mater and a flounder waffle. Abel got the French toast bounty platter. And Mama got a grilled chicken sandwich. Mm. Alright, we found some Skyliner merch we're going to take you through. First thing is this mug. I think this would be perfect on your desk, like a pen holder. Or something. Yeah. Just the shape. Yeah, the practicality of actually drinking out of it probably isn't there, but... I don't know, it's just, I don't know, kind of a funny shape. These are $19.99. They're really cute, though. Yeah, these ornaments, she said that um, they are they have different styles, she said. Mm -hmm. And they're almost out. They only have seven left here at Pop. Or no, we're... Art of animation, animation, but Pop has already sold out. And these are $27.99. So this is the Toy Story one, specifically. You can see the Toy Story characters in each window, they're which so I think cute. Abel would like. Yeah. Um, but I think that there are different designs, like each mom was saying, maybe Mickey and some other characters. These socks are stinking cute. Those are precious. And really, the the pattern is, I mean, subtle enough. I feel like that... Um, it says, or the Skyway. There's probably something there. My, My way. way. or the Skyway. Um, you know, for men especially, if you're just wearing that under yeah. your pants to work or something. I was looking for a price, but none of them are tagged. Oh, that's helpful. Thanks, Disney. <laughs> There's that one. Let's check out over here. Is that a and shirt? Cute Skyliner baseball. Is this baseball? Right? Yeah, one of the sleeves are different colored. These ones are $24.99. And then we have this cute baseball cap. That's the inside liner. And then, sorry, my hands are full. Oh, I can. This is Disney World, Walt Disney World. And then this is the front. It's really cute. cute. And it's a, it's a good weight. I like that one. It's not stiff or anything. Did I say the price came It is. $27.99. Look at the kid one. This one's $24.99. So cute. But I love that the red line has glitter. It's glittery. That's really sweet. I think these are really cool too, actually. And I, they look like glass online, but now with you lifting it so easy, I'm assuming they're plastic. It's just plastic. And it's not double walled, it's just kind of a thin plastic. So, okay. So here's the women's shirt. Um, this one is $34.99. And it's the same print, but it just is on a white tee with a gray um, ring, ringer tee. So it's got the um, cuffs and the neckline there. These are the toys that match the ornaments. So from what I understand, um, these ornaments came in these toy designs. So this is the Toy Story one. That's the ornament that we just showed you. They're really cute. These are $14.99. Oh, and it actually comes with a little stand. That's really cool. Put my um, camera cap right there. <laughs> Hopefully I don't forget. Here is the Star Wars one. Those are really cool. Let's see if I can carry everything here. Mama found something she wanted to look at, so she left me. <clears throat> so here's the men's shirt on a mannequin that we showed you earlier. And here's the women's shirt that was folded on the table. So it's like I said, same design. Yep, here's the um, other pattern. It's red and it's got the classic characters. Um, and then what I think is actually really cute, I'm not huge into magic bands, but these are really sweet. This is a limited release for the Skyliner. This is what the other side looks like. Again, these don't have a price, but 
Those are cool. Oh, I see one more of those Skyliner. It looks like maybe Haunted Mansion. Is this the same or is this different? Oh, yep, it is Haunted Mansion. That's cool. You can see Madame Leota. That's very cool. Um, and then the last thing I see over here are these buttons. I know these are really popular. They release these in the summer. Um, like snack ones and different things like that. And these are $9.99. So, very cool. We're done with breakfast. We got back on the Skyliner and are now at the Caribbean Beach um, Skyliner Depot. I'm kind of referencing this one as the TTC almost because this is the main one where you can get off to change tracks to go to other locations. So I'm stopping at the Joffrey's here because they have a, an exclusive Skyliner drink that I'm gonna grab for Abel. And then we'll hop back on the Skyliner and go the longest route up to Epcot. So I'm excited to do that, but let's check this out here. I'll just have nice water, please. All right, try that toffee flight. It looks really good, all the different toppings. Is it very sweet? But is it good? It's good. Good. It's very sweet. Usually I drink just black. Yeah, so I think anything aside from just black is probably very sweet. <laughs> okay, we'll have mom try some. Oh, again? stop. I'll get it again. Yeah. <laughs> I can't test try because I don't like coffee. Oh so no. So to me that tastes like straight up coffee. Oh. So to me it's sweet. Okay, it well. Sweet at, it's not sweet at all. To me, so good. that's just your, your taste preference. <laughs> just kidding. Alright, really well I'm good. glad you like it. I recommend it. Good. That's a good recommendation right there. <laughs> <laughs> oh look at the Epcot ball. In just a minute. We will be arriving at Disney Vacation Club that celebrates the relaxing no seaports and romantic vistas of the Mediterranean coast. That pulls open. Well, that guy looks good with that. Those are employees. With that pink thing hanging out. Ciao, bonjour, and bienvenue. Hello, and welcome to Disney Riviera Resort. Bienvenue, welcome. No gators down there. We're gonna turn here. Says who? No alligators, no crocodiles. They, they might have some frogs in there. Prince Charming. You know, it'd be a fun game. Aww. I'm sure they removed the Never kissed a frog. On the property. Never have. Especially at the Kind of cool. Oh, yeah, you do. You do every I day. So. Well, it's not. I don't think Mom was doing that to that. Oh. I think. <laughs> you keep trying, though. Try. Every morning. <laughs> there we go. Every morning, we're going to take off like, again. That's still him. I think that's cool. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> So now we're going towards the back of the France Pavilion, and I don't know if you can see from where I'm at, but Mom said that there's a sign for the Ratatouille ride that says opening summer 2020, you can kind of see. It's a bit of a glare on the wow, glass, too. Did you ride it in Paris? We are now arriving at Epcot. To all who come to this place of joy. And so you can see the Eiffel Tower is on a Welcome. building. That's what makes it look so far away. Yeah. I think that's the new Ratatouille attraction. So honey, I think we were standing, we were, we were standing yeah, right there where Sleeping Beauty met. Mm -hmm. When we could see him passing, we were right over there. Isn't that we weird? Until the Just last weekend we were standing right there when and we hadn't been on this yet. So we have to get out here, collect your belongings, and watch your steps. So once you arrive to Epcot, if you are just wanting to ride the Skyliner, you are prompted to exit, and then you would just walk around and get back on there. So it's definitely not as smooth where you can kind of just stay on and ride it out. There are several different points for on and off, but I think the experience overall has been really fun. Yeah. I thought it was cool. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it actually, and I have said since they started building it that I was not going to get on it, but I really liked it. Good. So this boardwalk down, right? All right, so we're 
Alright guys, we are back from our ride on the Skyliner. I loved it and would definitely recommend it if you are trying to get to any of the resorts or the parks that the Skyliner line hits. Um, I think we can all say that it was a really smooth ride. It was a comfortable ride. There was plenty of ventilation. I never felt hot at all. Um, and that's it. I really liked it. I would definitely recommend it. The sky just fell out of Oops. the car. So anyway. <laughs> um, yeah, okay. Oh, he was okay. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't try to be funny and like tumble out of the car. Anyway, um, if you enjoyed, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you aren't already, and I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.